I am a poet. I'm a poet for me, you, everybody. I am a poet because I need this, like water, air, food. I am a poet because of yesterday. I am a poet because of tomorrow. I am a poet because of right now. I am a poet working through my process. I am a poet therapeutically writing. I'm a poet making friends. I'm a poet sharing my life. I'm a poet working through relationships. I am a poet discerning manipulation. I am sharing my heart, history, emotions. I'm a poet working through COVID. I'm a poet creatively writing. I'm a poet growing, learning, crying, laughing, participating, loving in my life, your life, and our lives. My name is Rebecca Noel, and I'm a painter here in San Diego, California. I'm here at Balboa Park, where I spend a lot of my time painting and teaching painting. Putting who I am into my artwork is slightly complicated, because I have a lot of different interests and a lot of inspirations. Sometimes I hear that my work is too diverse to be recognizable, but it's really important to me to keep experimenting and to follow what's calling me. So to illustrate what I mean, I thought I'd show you some of the projects that I've been working on for the past couple of years. Let's take a look. I'm probably most known for my landscapes and architecture paintings. These are oil paintings usually. And this is a recent one of Space Mountain at Disneyland, one of my favorite places in the whole wide world from a photo I took a couple of years ago. I also love painting humans and animals. And this is a painting, an oil painting of my cat, Cece. I like to work with a palette knife as well with the oil paints, um, especially with desserts because it's almost like making a cake. You, know, you can see the texture of the oil paint that the palette knife makes. I love doing abstracts with the palette knife as well. Again, I'll show you the texture. It's almost like creating petals. And I work like this with buttercream on cakes as well. This is an acrylic abstract piece from my series called Liberté, Freedom in French. And these are just created very quickly with movement and purpose, color studies, shape studies. And this is from my series called Elements of Nature, watercolor orbs with pen drawings of found items from nature. This is a nasturtium root. And I also love to sew and craft, so I wanted to show you one of these. Last year I made a, ser a series of 40 Christmas tree topper angels, and in his own Hogwarts Express carrying case, Harry Potter. So that's just a few of the things that I've made in the past couple years. Thanks so much for watching and thank you to Rayanne Chanel at the Forever 7 for putting this together and for always keeping us inspired. Thanks guys, bye! <laughs>
It's about feeling accepted and feeling not accepted at times and feeling like that's okay too. Um, so for the 17 Days 17 Artist Challenge, it was about us showcasing not just our talent, but showcasing how much we believe in art and in joy and in peace and in love and how much we believe that art can help with that and can help us heal with that. So I want to shout out to everybody who was a part, everyone who has used the hashtag the forever seven and has just collaborated and has supported in the way that I have asked.